Hello folks, fellow YouTubers and friends. Well, our uh, VAWT up on the shop, turning pretty good, but uh, we've only got about two, three miles an hour wind right now, and it's not hooked up to a generator, so there's no strain on it. We're gonna build a bigger one, and we're gonna use 55 gallon drums. As you can see, Larry's cutting uh, one and a half right now with the torch. Oh, uh, by the way, we've uh, got away from uh, propane, I mean, uh, from acetylene. We're using propane, I bought a special set of gauges and hose. And propane ha uh, is a little bit hotter than acetylene, and it's a whole lot cheaper. All right. Anyway, let's get back to the VAWT that we're building now. And uh, what we're doing is this round part right here, right here. Is one half of a big spool of that big heavy uh, plastic pipe, the orange pipe that they use for gas lines and stuff like that. The mechanism for it to turn is nothing more than the spindle off of a trailer axle. And you can buy those at the prices, but I mean, if they're strong, you can buy them at uh, Northern Industrial Tool or even uh, Harbor Freight for like 35 45 bucks. And uh, what we did is we bought a go kart sprocket, 10 inch diameter sprocket, for 40, number 41, uh, schedule 41 chain. And we took it to a machine shop and had them cut a, a hole in the center, big enough for the back of the spindle to go down into. And the back of the spindle has uh, three lug holes. So we took it to the four inch pipe, which slides over the back side of the spindle and uh, put some half inch all thread rod, put it in the holes with nuts on it, pull it down snug and weld it to the pipe. So that holds everything in the pipe. And it makes it so we can actually take it off of the pipe. Now the four inch pipe, three and a half inch pipe slides right up inside a four inch pipe really snug. And what we did is we drove up two before in the ground to put the pipe over so we could work on this thing. Now we, right now we have the Spool we've got has six spokes. Some of these spools have eight, some of them have six. I like the six because it looks like three steel things. Now with six spokes, what we're going to do, and that's whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, she got some torque to her, friend. All right, we'll put her on up at three positions. And then we'll put at the other three positions, we put the barrel down. There, that way, that barrel is not going to interfere with this barrel. The wind. See, the wind is coming straight this way, and that way, right there, it will be blocking this one. Now, it's going to, you're going to have twice the torque. I don't really think it's going to speed up it, but it's still going to squeeze things out a lot better. Right now, you can't hardly see that it is jumping just a little bit. You can't in slow motion. But uh, it's real, real good. Okay. Uh, oh, by the way, <laughs> this is not the big one, Brother Bill. My brother's always getting on me about, why do you build it so big? Because I want more power. Anyway, this is not our big, this is just uh, uh, experiment and practice. The bigger one we want to build is going to be anywhere from five to six barrels high. The barrels are 34 inches, and this is two inches, so it will actually be three foot per section. And if we go six barrels, it's going to be 18 feet. So it'll... And uh, we're going to stiffen it up so that we bring, these are eight foot in diameter. We're going to try to bring the barrels out one foot out. We might have to weld a little extension out there to make it stiff so it'll be stronger. And that one should be exactly outside to outside, 10 feet in diameter. That's going to really give us some torque. I mean, really torque. Uh, the 20 kW generator that I ordered from uh, Poland got here uh, around the turn of the year in January. And uh, we're going to try to deal with something big enough to turn it. Okay, you folks have a great weekend. We'll talk to you later. When we get this thing done, we're going to clean it up and paint it, make it look pretty. And uh, that's it. Any questions, just make a comment.